The affected 400 workers are employed by the subcontractors whose contract will come to an end with the city of Windhoek as their provision of the cleaning services. The 400 workers march to the city of Windhoek offices and demand audience with the acting CEO to contract the period of their employment with the city of Windhoek is ending next year. In June this year, the city of Windhoek has requested to consult Manu before the advertising of the tender of the cleaning services. However, the union say it's a dismay to learn at the constituency meeting that the tender has already been advertised, forcing the union to march to the offices of the city of Windhoek. Initially, the employees wanted to march on Monday to the city of Windhoek. However, the acting CEO, Philemon Hamuda, requested the group to cancel the march and have a meeting with the union management. On Tuesday, when the representative of the employees and the subcontractors arrived at the office, he refused to meet with the group because it's too large. He insisted he wanted to only meet with the union representative, Justina Johannam. He only wants to talk to me alone. I said I do not represent myself. I represent people, and those people are affected. They are sitting in the bedroom. But the acting CEO denied the allegation. As far as I'm concerned, I did not call anybody a mob. I said I could not talk to a group, and I wanted to talk to her to say what she don't want to listen. The acting CEO of the city of Windu later decided that both the union leadership and the contractor's management they resulted to a temporary and putting the current ongoing tender process on hold with an extension of the contracts to June next year while they are exploring the situation. For NBC News, Sakias Tumuna, Vendog.